I think I'm gonna get them all level 55, then try and take down that fighting bitch again. Fighting bitch? Eerie. She is. I love Eerie. She is amazing. Who? Big buff woman. Uh, one of the Team Star leaders. Oh, is Team Star a good or a bad group? Both. What? Gray. It's gray. Okay. Like I said, both. Well, I fucked up my sandwich. I was gonna say something. But I think it would have been pretty bad. Uh, oh, I still need to write down for my 18th birthday I want to play Cards Against Humanity. thing is, I was going to say, like, Dragon said how they said I fucked up my sandwich. I was going to say, oh yeah, just like how I fucked up my life. <laughs> I don't know why oh. these thoughts come in my head. <laughs> it's Are just the okay? immediate, immediate. I don't think she's okay. The immediate thought is what terrifies me. Like how that immediately clicked into my head still terrifies me. <laughs> the second I Okay, right. <laughs> oh. oh wow. Why is, why At least I'm not Donald Trump. That's all that matters. What? It's my phone. Ah, uh, hello, Hatchet. <laughs> and I'm six is screaming because when I came back, the first thing I heard you say was Donald Trump. Oh. Okay, sh should I explain the Hatchet about the dragon thing? Do I want to know? Okay. The, my immediate thought that went in my head was when Dragon said, uh -huh. um, I fucked up my sandwich. My immediate thought was, went, went, wanted me to say, my brain immediately wanted me to say was, yeah, Dragon fucked up their sandwich as much as I fucked up my life. <laughs> I, I don't know why that was my first thought. But it fucked was. Fucked up many people's lives, Bryant. For good um, or for worse? Who knows? Um... Right? Yeah. That doesn't explain why when I first got back in, the first thing I heard you say was Donald Trump. Oh, th then I said, well, at least I'm not Donald Trump. Uh, <laughs> that's a pretty low bar you're setting there, Bright. <laughs> I don't think highly of myself. At least I'm not a fascist with daddy issues who basically got everything handed to him in life and bankrupted multiple businesses of his own. As well as destroying an entire football team. Did y'all know that? What? Or not football team, football league. Back in what? the... Back in, I think, the late 60s, early 70s, there was actually a competing football league to the NFL. Um, that was, oh, I don't remember the exact name of it. Something like, uh, U uh, United States Football League, like something along those lines, or United States Football Association. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, Donald Trump was really fucking pissed. At, you know, like being a big man-child. And he decided that he was going to join in with the investors on this competing league uh, because he had like issues with one or two people that were on the investment team of the NFL. And uh, he basically ended up just completely destroying the league with his policies that he really, really heavily pushed through. 
Like, oh. the league went completely bankrupt within a year of him getting there. I feel like he did that on purpose, since he didn't like that. No, he doesn't like the, uh, the NFL. Like, he was trying to get this company to crush the NFL. Oh. Well, and then he destroyed that. And, and then, and then he made the NFL the only, uh, football league in America. The only thing I remember from the NFL was was the ad that had Pug Monkey Baby. I don't even know what you're talking. Oh wait. Oh god, no. You know what? Never mind. I'm gonna go back to sharks. Fuck you. <laughs> I made you remember. Do I wanna know? Pug Monkey no. Baby. Pug Monkey Baby. Pug Monkey Baby. Shut up, I don't even know what that is, but I want you to shut up. <laughs> is, that the, is that the first time Jerry's ever told me to shut up? No. Maybe. It's not the first, and it probably won't actually, be the last. Actually, what it is, is it's probably happened so often that our brains forget about it. It's like the sound of you... It's like the sound of our... Uh, of breathing. Like ourselves breathing. Like, most of the time you forget that it's there because you're just so used to it. Oh wait, Hatchet, I want to ask you a question. Did you see that Jurassic Park thing I sent you? Yeah. Did Holy you... fucking shit, it's a dinosaur. <laughs> That's my favorite Jurassic Park opening. <laughs> That's not an opening, it's a, it's a fan parody, you dingus. Oh, I mean, yeah, fan parody. My favorite fan parody. I am, I am going to take an image of... Uh, no. Well, fuck you, too. <laughs> I'm going to take an image of a uh, chain cat shark bioluminescing, and I'm going to put in neon, like, as, as neon green as I can get, big letters that says, uh, glow-in-the-dark Neko shark. No. What did you say? I said no. Fuck you. I love being an asshole. You will be made to accept the glow-in-the-dark Neko Shark. No. You will accept them into your hearts. No. You can say no all you want, but they will enter your heart. No. Hey, They'll probably I'm... kill you by entering your heart. No. I feel like Bright has shut down into idiot no. <laughs> That's what? basically half of that's that's half of what Bright's always doing. Two, three. Are you saying she's four. typically just an idiot going no Eight. half the time? Kind of, yeah. Ten. Seven. Fifteen. Oh my god. Eight. Sixteen. No, what? child, stop. Seventeen. Child, child, ten. don't teach Bright numbers. It's getting worse. <laughs> ten. Okay. Twenty-five. So the max is ten. Ten every five minutes. <laughs> Ten every five minutes. That's that's good. That's you're good. Really, you're really. I am accident. I am mass producing apples. Apple no, dragons. Like no. Yes. So you're saying I can get the iPhone 15? What? No. No. <laughs> I don't even think that exists. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is this a chain shark? I don't know if it's a chain shark. Let me look. Okay, so... The chunk. Cephalcillium the ventrosium. Oh, no, it's not a... Oh, okay. It's not a chain cat shark that can bioluminesce. It's the swell shark. Good job. <laughs> Hey, don't blame me. Blame Google. No. I ty I typed in chain cat shark, and they showed me pictures of a bioluminescing swell shark. Not my problem. What? Is that not my problem? Yeah, no shit, it's not your problem. It's Google's problem. What? Did you forget what this conversation was about? <laughs> no. I think she's not thinking because she's too stupid to think. I need to check something. No. Shut the fuck up. 
That may as well be my catchphrase at this rate. No. Let me check. Iron. Bryce! Why are you saying no? Because <laughs> I can. That just makes you look stupid. Yeah. Also, uh, apparently Grand Inferno is going to be either in the high 70s or in the middle 70s by the time I get everyone to 55. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> How closely related. How high is your Grand Inferno, Dragon? Dragon? Hmm? How high is your Grand Inferno? Uh, in the 50s. Oh, mine's almost, I think. mine's almost I 70. Check. I'm shiny hunting, so I'm not really grinding. Have you even finished the game? Well, I finished. Okay, I did all of Team Star shit. I did all of fucking Team... Not Team Star. Team Star, the regular gems, and the legends. Did you fight the guy by the tower? No. Oh my gosh. You have to go to the tower to fully complete I know I have to, okay, I know I have to go to the tower, but did you know you have to fight someone at the school? And also, I beat all of Team Star, which you have to fight a dude after you beat Team Star. Huh. Okay. I think I just found another example of um, Sharks common mating. names being dumb. I'm looking through... Uh, the genuses, or the families and genuses of, uh, oh no, never mind. I'm just being dumb. Wait, no? Wait, what? what? It's not me I who's need... being dumb? I need to figure a way out to make my Gaian avatar not look like a stripper. <laughs> um, okay. Time to soar. Okay, yeah, I was being dumb. I was just misreading the wiki. Ooh, I need to get bamboo sharks as well in here. I love bamboo sharks. They're ASMR, so re removing your heart surgery. That probably exists. Are you okay? Epilet shark? Ooh, epilets are? I didn't know epilets are carpet sharks. Did you, know that the, did you know that the dark web has ASMR? I'm Nobody look at the dark web. Nobody look at the dark web. Bright's just stupid. <laughs> what? The ASMR is not that bad. It's the dark web. I mean, there is a lot of screaming, but, uh, you know, it's it's okay. I feel Jiri judging me right now. <laughs> I am judging I you! Why. It sounded like, did Spoot just, like, in response to say, response to that say, full of judgment. They said so much mud judgment, such wow. Oh. Oh dang. Yeah, I guess that's a. I guess that's a good example of why I'm. I'm not a goddamn. Uh, shark scientist. What? I was basically like following up on a hunch of mine. I noticed that cat sharks actually look very similar to blind sharks. Uh. So, like, my first thought was they maybe they're... Related. Huh? They're related. Yeah, my, my first thought was maybe they're related. And I look into it, and uh, they're about as far related as you can get between two different types of shark. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the blind shark doesn't have any close relatives. Uh, oh they my are, gosh, I want to kill a monkey. Um, they're classified under carpet sharks. And a couple, uh, like a handful of layers down. Let me go look. You know, I yeah, and the cat one. sharks are uh, classified, I think, under cart cards. Oh, 
Hey, yeah, Hatchet, if I get a monkey as a pet, can I keep it? No. Why? Well, maybe. What kind of monkey? The one I'm looking at. Oh, and Pokemon? Yeah, sure. Yay! Now I just gotta figure out how to bring it out in real life. Don't no. do that. Why not? What do you Tell think? Uh, huh, it's six foot seven, so the monkey will be bigger than me. Jesus. That means I can ride it. Don't ride the monkey. That's a weird. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like a euphemism. It does. Don't, it mind it. Don't ride the monkey. <laughs> Even I recognize that sounds like euphemism and I hate it. You're welcome. Get your minds out of the gutter. No. Die. Oh yeah, okay, so... Yeah, so, um... The lion sharks and cat sharks separate at the super order. They are both a part of Gallomorphy, but blind sharks are in the carpet sharks, the aura... Or I didn't know what blind, shark, blind sharks were carpet sharks because well, they look similar to them. And uh, things I've read about blind sharks, they just sound different than other carpet sharks with how little interest uh, humans generally have in blind sharks. Oh yeah, they but don't... that's yeah, but that's not much of a distinguishing factor. That's fair. It has, that has nothing to do with genetics, really. Or does In the it? same way that, like, like carpet sharks think, like, what do you think, like, when, you, when I say carpet shark, what do you think of? Death shark. No! Shut up. Carpet bomb. Carpet <laughs> bomb. Well, I guess, I guess besides, now that I've brought it up, blind sharks, like, when I say carpet shark, can you, do you think of any specific sharks? Uh, the basking shark? You hurt my brain, Bright. You said they were mostly... sharks, so I thought of a shark. Can when I... I say carpet shark. I feel like everyone is responding before I can respond. Yeah, like I'm Thank primarily you, asking Jerry here. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I want to respond! Sorry. I'm sorry, Jerry. I'm sorry. Carpet sharks are a generally very wide range of types of sharks. Although they're labeled sharks, I'm not sure I would label all of them as sharks. They generally live around the bottom and rather they don't all eat other fish. I think a lot of them just eat sediments. You mean, uh, filter feed? Yeah. Some filter, yeah. So, most of them are pretty harmless as long as them alone. Yeah. Okay, so what if I mentioned that whale sharks are carpet sharks? Oh. Whale sharks and blind sharks look very different. Oh, I see. Not, I, I get it. I get what yeah. you're saying. Just because it's a carpet shark doesn't mean it's closely related to other carpet sharks. Yeah, they're very different looking. That, that's fair. That's fair. I was thinking, but... oh, the blind shark does have close relatives. No, that does not mean it has close relatives. I'm going to look to see if they do. Actually, yeah, let me... Oral click to forms. Yeah, like right now we're talking mostly on order level. Let me go. Uh, blind shark, blind shark. I think they are like one of the only sharks in their genus and family. If I'm it correct. sounds like they are the closest relative is the blue gray carpet shark. Yeah, and th those two are the only within the genus. Brachelia, 
Brachylurus no, and the I'm family. Now I'm going to look up what the blue gray carpet shark is. Oh, yeah. they look pretty! Pretty boys! Actually, ironically enough, it seems that nurse sharks are similarly, like, unique in terms of their uh, relation to other carpet sharks. As blind sharks. As in not having many relatives? Oh no, why is Nimona yeah. trending? Oh, that's uh -huh. why. <laughs> wait, I'm putting in a dumb post. Wait, is it a wait, spoiler? wait, 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 wait. Okay, you can't wait. I'm putting in a dumb post. Uh, I want to know your opinion. Is it a spoiler? Is there a spoiler? No, no, no. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah, nurse sharks share. Yeah, sh nurse sharks literally have one other shark in their genus and family. Oh, I see. And that's it. Well, welcome to Bright Silently Plays Pokemon while Jerry and I nerd out about sharks. I just don't know what to like talk about. It seems like the only visual difference I can see between the two is uh, Kolkov's shark is a little chunkier naturally than the blind shark, and it's not really spotted. But the two look so similar that in the results, I'm getting some blind shark and some of the blue gray shark. Yeah, though that's also probably just because the internet's not very good about, like, bringing up pictures of the right species of shark when you look for a specific shark. Also, like, sadly, most of the pictures I have seen have, like, titles on it. That makes me sad. Yeah. The internet has already... <laughs> Apparently okay. it's... This one isn't the internet ru ruining Sharks. Nimona, but the internet has already ruined Nimona by calling her, a, and I quote, a stalker yandere. Some people need to go outside and interact with people. Also, desperately. Um, I decided to see uh, Google News, like, to see what they have. The first thing I Food, see is- I thought you were going to share, like, the coffee noodles and dump them. Anyway, the first thing I see is, uh... Yeah. Is uh, Nintendo giving re uh, refunds for Pokemon and uh, Scarlet and Violet? Like immediately, just one day ago, that's been posted. Why? I don't know. Apparently, people don't like the game. Open up, open up a new tab and see the reason. Should I? feel happy or yeah. frustrated that the best picture I found of a blind shark was while trying to find a different shark? <laughs> oh, it's Maybe. Because, it's because of the glitches. Uh, yeah, I, I saw that image when I was like looking for blind shark pictures, but I decided against it because I wanted a closer up uh, oh. image of one. Like, when I'm finding images, I generally try to get ones that, at the very least, show a decent bit of their uh, bodily characteristics. That's fair. And I, I, I think I found a better one than that when I found Blind Shark. But that is a really pretty picture of one. That is a, that is a sweet and handsome boy. Why is there a picture of the blue gray shark's crotch? Uh, also, there's like I don't uh, know. I don't know either, and I don't like it. My internet, why? Why? That's probably gonna haunt me for a bit. Apparently, everyone. Hey, hey, everyone. Fun fact: Did you know that bull sharks, when they're swimming in fresh water, urinate approximately sixty times as much as when they're in salt water? Wow. Fun fact. <laughs> That's because they have an easier time with salt water. Also, yeah. um, uh, I, I found two news articles that I find interesting. One is apparently Nintendo is doing DMCA takedowns on any pictures on Steam that have anything to do with Pokemon Scarlet, Violet, Splatoon 3, Xenoblade Chronicles 3, Super Mario Odyssey, and Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. 
So why? yeah, get, uh, they don't know. Uh, they don't say why. They just don't like it. In other news, Sonic the Hedgehog creator is is arrested, arrested. in Japan. Yep. I'm not surprised. Wait, what? Why? Something about uh, Dragon Age shit. Hold on, one more second. Alleged Dragon insider shit. trading. Oh. I think it had something to do with no Dragon Quest, not Dragon Age. Dragon Quest. How should I think? I found a picture yeah, of what Dragon looks Quest. like what looks like a blind shark just staring at the camera. Oh, am I gonna be able to make my no bitches meme with a blind shark? No. What? <laughs> uh, yeah, I was planning to make like a shark version uh, of the no bitches. Well, how is, the, how is the blind shark be going to be able to see if you have bitches? I think uh, the blind shark would be it's always not going no bitches. It's blind. It's called that because it looks blind while it's on land because it can close its eyelids to preserve uh, the liquid in their uh, eyes. Yeah, the mucous membranes. Yeah. Besides that, like ultimately, I mean, sharks could pretty easily tell if you had no bitches uh, because of their electroreception. They, they could easily sense whether or not you had bitches with you. Also, if that shark had fingers, I could totally see them going snap, snap, snap at you. <laughs> <laughs> Just like I... sassily swimming up to you while snapping. No bitches. <laughs> <laughs> Maidenless. Okay, I'm gonna keep this one in like my back pocket if I don't find a better image for the no bitches meme. <laughs> that is a very nice image. That was I an accident. It. I was just looking for the blue gray carpet shark. Why is that so hard to find? Probably because it's a more obscure species. So is the blind shark. Oh yeah, but it's the blind shark's less obscure. That's fair, I guess. Wait, why is... Th I'm gonna look why this one is obscure. Well, my... At the very least, my, uh... uh my Glone the Dark Cat Shark or Neko Shark meme still works because Swell Sharks are Cat Sharks. But it's just the picture I was going to use is not the correct species of cat shark that I thought it was, which makes me sad. Oh, that's just fucking sad. I I'm I think I'm seeing why. Uh, oh, the blue crate carpet shark is unlike the. Its cousin, the blind shark, seems to be uncommon and is actually threatened because of uh, commercial fisheries and the uh, aquarium trade. Oh, that's nice. That's nice! So, while, while people can't uh, fish tra trade the blind shark, I guess they can fish trade its cousin, which, you know, totally not a dick move. I'm being sarcastic. Where are you? Okay. No, because I feel like the biggest issue with people saying Nimona is a stalker or a yandere is the fact that they have never said this shit about any of the male rivals, who have acted very similarly. Never. Not once ever mentioned anything about being yandere or being a stalker. Not fucking once. But when a woman does the same shit that the men have been doing for fucking decades. Then it becomes a fucking problem. Then it'd be like, oh, they're hot yandere. Mm, yeah, yeah. Shut the fuck up. I hate. I hate how people treat female characters. I hate it so much. I'm going to snap someone I like a twig. Also, I found an okay picture of a blue-gray carpet shark. It doesn't show the whole body, but it shows a good portion of its face. 
Although for some reason there's a fish on top of it. It's just staring at the camera like a fish. Oh the fit Oh the fish on top of it is a remora. Oh shark sucker. Aren't they like I bad guess for it's shark? cleaning them? I uh, know remoras are pretty much parasitic sharks that just oh! that, that just okay. hang or, or well remoras aren't sharks but they're a fish that hangs around larger marine organisms to like grab at scraps that they leave behind oh, okay so it's hanging around to eat whatever scraps the shark leaves okay yeah it's not I the it's, it's, it's not like the standard type of it. yeah it's not it's not cookie cutter shark type parasite it's okay, just that, it's, that's okay then. It's okay. Yeah, they're they're just clingers. They 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 stick around and they annoy them. It's actually a large, largely thought that these fuckers are the main reason why a lot of ray species will breach, just to get them the fuck away from them. Because <laughs> yeah, the fuck they're this? annoying as fuck. What the fuck is this? Oh, is that that a person? Like... It's a fucking glowing sword. Did you try pulling it? There's an obvious black oh, stake driven thing. into the ground. Will you pull out the stake? Not... Sure. Huh? Oh, what did I just do? Something. Yeah, I keep finding those and I keep picking those up and I don't know what it does. When you pull out the stake, it crumbled and vanished. Okay. What? Well, what looks like Bright's gone crazy. Let's move on. Or it's cursed. Bright's not cursed. No, no, to be fair, to be fair, the game. The game had that happen. It's it's not something. It, it's not insanity. Yeah, I have it happen in my game too. So. Yeah, that's not that's not helping Bright's case. That just means you're shut also up. crazy. Probably, but also shut up. <laughs> yeah, that's shit. I'm at the tallest peak now. I see. Also, I'm sad because swell sharks. You wanna you wanna guess why they're called swell sharks? Why? Uh, cause people named them that because they're a deep sea shark, and when they catch them, they swell up. I wonder why. Uh. I I just I I love how so many deep sea fish get named off of. People reacting in horror to barotrauma. I am finding a few okay blue gray carpet sharp pictures, but nothing that's like amazing. Yeah, I'm not sure I'm... how I feel about that. It looks so pretty, but wait, is that a fucking derpy pic? Is that a... no? That's a derpy picture of a white tip uh, reef shark. Uh -huh. That is so derpy. Oh no, I'm gonna share it because it's derpy, aren't I? Probably. But yeah, I'm probably I'm probably not going to add uh these boys to the deck just because again, there's so many fucking fish. That's okay. Mm. Also, look at that derp face and tell me it's not derp. <laughs> <laughs> Has that shark been smoking? <laughs> I don't know. Wait. No, wait. The game fucked up. It put me in an area where I'm constantly gonna be jumping in an area they don't want me in. Oh, I, I found have... a pretty picture of a... I... Oh, no, that's a nurse shark. God fucking damn it. I got stuck. <laughs> I'm gonna try and climb my way right. out. Right, go to the fucking Pokey Center. Uh, yeah, thanks for that. Look at that pretty picture of a nurse shark. I'm. Also, that's so pretty. That is a really pretty picture of a shark. Shark. Sure. So many shark. Mm, I agree. All of your I... shark belong to us. Fuck. All the penguin memes belong to us. No. Fuck you. All all of your shark are belong to us. You wanna see a funny goofy looking motherfucker? Sure. No. I want you to guess what this penguin's name is. 
Also, uh, also, apparently I climbed up so high that I went over the world barrier and got into an area area I'm not supposed to go into till I defeat this last last bitch. I somehow managed it. I don't know. And you how. can't fly off. No, <laughs> the only way how fast is to... travel. Yeah, the only way is fast travel. You know what? I give up on finding good pictures of the blue gray carpet shark. I'm upset because they look like pretty boys, but. I guess people are dicks to the pretty boys because they want the pretty boys in their tanks because fuck people. Yeah. Okay, I want you I want you to look at this goofy motherfucker, right? And I want you to guess what this goofy motherfucker is called. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I, one more. I will name him Sherman. <laughs> that is Sherman. He ha he has a legal uh, legal name. That is not yeah. Sherman. That it's yes. not Sherman. It's well, not his, Sherman. well, his, well, his, well, maybe, well, his legal name is his dead name. His true name is Sherman. That is a guess. Guess. Guess what it's called. Guess what the type of penguin is called. Yes. Um. I. I don't fucking know. Just say. Did you know that there's a widower penguin and a widow penguin that like to hang out together in one zoo? I think so, yeah. But, okay, so that penguin type that I sent, it, it's called the chin strap penguin. Can you uh, guess why? Can you guess why? Well, no shit. Oh, God. <laughs> that I could have guessed that if I tried hard enough. Is it bad that I wish the blue-gray sharks were as much of assholes as the blind sharks so nobody would bother them? Yeah. Nah. Nah, that's not bad. Like, okay, well, yeah, it's not bad. What are you doing? Huh? I, I just said, what the fuck are you doing? You were just weirdly climbing on this giant gym monolith thing. Oh, I'm just trying to see if I can see any more of those uh, weird fucking swords. Okay, so I'm guessing the sandwich wall. Rods. Right. Or rods, whatever they're called. Oh, Dark Pulse! Oh, I should probably... Probably just fucking hatch the eggs I have. Actually, how many eggs do I have? Let me, let me check. Let's see, guess how many eggs it. I have. How many apple Ooh, eggs nice. does the... It's little shit. Oh my how, god, Jesus Christ. How many immorally acquired apple eggs <laughs> has the child acquired? It's Sounds not like immoral a... if the government doesn't uh, if the government doesn't know about it. A ac actually no. <laughs> Gen uh, uh, wait, no, you said if the government doesn't know about it. No. Mm -hmm. I thought you're going to say like it's not immoral if the government doesn't say it's moral and I was going to say if the government says it's moral, it's probably immoral. Yeah, if the government doesn't know about it, it's moral. So guess how many eggs I have. That that's not what it means, penguin. Shut up. Guess how many eggs I have. That's thirty. Fifty thousand. Okay. Yeah. okay. Now let's see. So you've been saying that it takes about ten eggs for five minutes. You've been doing this for maybe since late last night. So what's? Well, I only started doing it like a, a bit ago. So. Oh, just a little. Oh, so this is like just from a little bit ago. Mm -hmm. Like how long ago? I can't say because then you'll be able to do the math on how many I have. Uh, actually, you know what? No, I will. Okay, so I, I counted will? how many I have. I no. Okay, I will say I counted how many I have. Uh, so I would say an hour ago. An hour ago. So ten times. Uh, twenty. So is that 200? So I'm guessing somewhere around 200. I have 96. Maybe half an hour ago. I think I did my math. Wait. Maybe, maybe 40 minutes? No, 40 minutes. wait. I did my I did my no, math it, wrong. No, it was an hour. Never mind. Because I think the sandwiches last uh, 30 minutes. Are they? Well, how many? F okay, five minutes. How many five minutes are there in an hour? So 10, 15. 20? I think. 5, no, 10, 20. 15, 20, oh, no, 25, 20. 30. So yeah, there's 10. Is that 10. a shoulder? 
Okay, okay, yeah, so there's ten. So if you were doing it for about an hour, it should have been about a hundred. I I missed I messed up my math. Yeah. So yeah, that's a that's about a round expectation. That means it would only take about six hours if I re or like seven maybe at most. Uh, if I got really unlucky. I love yeah. Hellboy. Yeah, it's the first introvert in all the Pokemon minute. game. It takes about a minute to hatch them all. Oh, me? What? Me? No. I was saying okay, the Pokemon you're know fighting. You know what? Okay. Right, right. I'll make you a deer. A deal, okay? I'll make deer. you a deal. I will make shut you up. a deer. Shut, fuck up. shut up, shut up. I if like I, I, if I, I was somehow. I just say the bright was totally ignored and it's still being spoken over. Apparently. What's going on now? What? Okay, Bright, I'll make you a deal. If I somehow manage to get two Applin, I will give you an, a shiny Applin. Well, what I want. And you can do whatever you want with it. Anyway, I was trying to talk to Bright, telling her that uh, I love the Pokemon she was. I love the Pokemon she she was about to fight. Although everyone spoke over me, so. Right. Now it's happening after it was fighting. It is literally the first introvert Pokemon from the first Pokemon game. It is the ultimate leave me the hell alone. Oh, sorry. Sorry. And Penguin, your Pokemon breeding is immoral. It's. It, I never said it was moral. I said. Oh, actually, no. Technically. Yeah, yes, said, oh, you fuck, have said I... multiple times that it's not immoral, which implies that it is is either amoral or moral. Look, I, I'm running something that might count as capitalistic, and we all know how capitalism is. Might sound like. What are you going might to name Zelda? They evolve into Cloyster, which is a bigger introvert that wants people to leave them alone. Wait, what? No! <laughs> I can't answer no! that name. <laughs> what what name? You... Oh, I'm not on the screen. What was the name? An adult female body part. Oh, oh. come on, Bright. Grow up. <laughs> yes, no! I can add that. I can add that. <laughs> oh, what is it? Catch it, you'll like it. That's two eighteen plus. Change it. Well, I'm not uh, actually uh, watching the stream right well, now. Well, I mean, I'm, Bright's I'm already named it the full word before. Uh. Honestly, this is just bare ba bare bones. This is bare ba basic bitch Bright over here. Oh wait, I no. To, I thought you were going to trade that. That shell, the shelter. That's why I'm kind of horrified. Sending food to some, to some random person. Right, already did that once. Oh. Right, sent. Right, sent one that was named that, like the full word. Wait, to someone. Poopa? What's Poopa? Fatty under pelvic area. Oh. <laughs> right. What? Why? Because I can. Sharks. Oh, damn. I'll take that. I didn't even see what I got. Thanks. Thanks, How game. Many? Flamethrower. Food, would you like this? Flamethrower oh, yeah. now, later. Okay. I forgot Gyarados can learn flamethrower. Yeah. With most fish, you would ask why, but Gyarados, you kind of ask why not. Oh yeah, Fla Gyarados can also learn fire blast. It's 
Gyarados. Why are you surprised? It was Gyarados is a bad the... bitch. Gyarados was so OP in the first game, they had to power it down because it, you could literally beat the entire game with only a Gyarados. Wait, actually, have you seen <gasps> some- uh, there was a person back. on YouTube. Huh? Look, okay. just messaging Jerry. chat. Jerry, there was a person on YouTube that deadass beat the entire- I think it was a uh, Pokemon Red. They beat all of Pokemon Red with a single Magikarp. Oh, not even Gyarados? How did they do that? Don't worry about I it. I don't know, and I am too afraid to ask. But they did it. That crazy son of a bitch did it. Harp are already powerful enough. We don't need to be giving them that much self-confidence. Okay, I'm gonna do a timer, and I'm gonna see how uh, how long it takes to hatch five eggs with flame body. One, okay, go. No. Harp are glow- Harp are OP as hell. May I just say the apple dragon is a good boy, and you do not need- to treat it badly. Um, um, <laughs> what? Uh, stuff? Uh, Are you glued to the uh, mountain? <laughs> unstuck. She is unstuck. <laughs> that was hilarious. Okay, so it takes more than 30 seconds for the first egg. Note to self. Bright is easily amused. <laughs> I love I game like glitches. I mean, who doesn't love game glitches? Me. God, I hate. Okay, so it takes about fifty seconds for the first egg to hatch, and then, okay, how? I'm I'm just gonna keep the. I want to see how long it takes me to go down. God, I. God, I hate pop science. What? Science. I I'm like looking at some pictures of uh, swell sharks, and I get a pop science article that's like. Female shark learns to reproduce without males after years alone. What? That's the not how it works. That, that's not. That's not how a. Oh, what's what's the name of it? Um. I forget the exact term, but that's not how that works. Yeah. They don't learn to reproduce like that. They just, like, that's something that does exist within several shark species. Also, uh, like, oh, I'm sorry. Uh. Are you done, Hatchet? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, apparently we're going to find something interesting. Apparently, the Terra Raid battle music where we fight the crystal Pokemon. Uh, mm -hmm. Toby Fox was the composer. It's always oh. Toby Fox that makes the best music for the Pokemon games. I fucking love the Pokemon uh, game music, but Toby Fox has been producing absolute fucking bangers for like the past two generations, and I fucking love it. Yeah. Okay. I'll I don't. Play. I don't know who that is. They created Undertale. Yeah. Oh. He's also just a pretty cool dude, and like he he was a Homestuck fan, but. Actually, All fault aside, uh, he made uh, he made Delta Room and made or is making Delta Room for Homestuck, so he wasn't just a fan. Yeah, calling him well, a, technically... a fan just feels inaccurate. And there's some amazing music he's made for uh, Homestuck. Wait, Hedge, do you yeah. still uh, do you actually know who he is after I said Undertale or no? Well, yeah, I know what Undertale is. Yeah, he created Undertale. Okay, so it takes about three minutes for me to hatch five eggs. It's actually interesting. I did not know that before. Toby Fox is... He is... He is... He is... He is Toby Fox. Yeah, isn't his other friend a really good friends with the, um, the creator of Smash Brothers? I have no yep, idea. that's how Sans got into Smash. That's how Sans got into Smash. Is they played, I uh, the, they played a thing of uh, like a few rounds of Smash, and I think the creator of Smash was like, "Hey, if you win against me, you can have any character of yours added to Smash." And Toby Fox was like, "Okay, cool." And he won. 
And guess what funny skeleton is in the game of Sans. Smash Bros. Yep. Okay. Also with oh, Megalovania. Okay. Oh, okay, so... Oh, it's Sakurai. I forgot uh, I forgot his name for a moment. It's Sakurai. Sakurai created Smash. Uh... So apparently I was not lied to, and the chain... <sighs> the chain cat shark does bioluminesce. It's just the photo I had sent you was not a chain cat shark. It was a swell shark. Why did I hatch a lechonk from an egg? What? Why are you here? What? Oh, wait. wait. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wait, what did those apples get up to? <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> wait, no, I know why. I know why now. Uh, I accidentally produced one lechonk egg uh, a while back, and I guess I just f put it in with my apple eggs and just forgot <laughs> about it. I was like, wait, what? Oh, God, what did they? What, what happened? It wasn't shiny, so it doesn't really matter. Kill it then. Get some nice bacon. Yeah, the only Pokemons that matter are these very specific rare genetic mutations that I'm aiming to get. <laughs> yeah. The only, just like how the only gar that matters are those like handfuls of albino alligator gar that people gawk over. Hey Hatchet, I'm gonna send a video over to you. A degenerate, but Dasani water Angiri. isn't that bad. I know it's bad and for the Dragon. environment, but I'm lazy. I'm very gonna be questioned for my video that I send in. Let's see. What was I gonna say this? Hello. 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 Dark Neko Shork. Okay, now what the fuck did you send me? You'll see. Will I see? Yeah. How do you know I'm not just gonna completely avoid our DMs forever? Then you'll never get to see my special DMs I'll send you from time to time. I'm not playing that. Why? Because the thumbnail scares me. There's nothing wrong with the thumbnail. Uh, this is... I don't... I, I clicked on it. I don't like that I clicked on it. Oh, no. It just shows you how Pokemon food is made in the Pokemon universe. In the Pokemon universe. It's just how it's Do you think there's a Pokemon uh, world equivalent of PETA? Yeah. Uh, we already knew there is. It's Team Plasma. No, Team Plasma doesn't euthanize innocent Pokemon. Well, yeah, they don't euthanize, but, like, they're basically them, and doesn't better. They don't bully the homeless. That's true. Or make women, uh, pregnant women in cages naked in the cold. What the fuck? Oh, yeah, yeah, they, they did, did that. that. Who did that? Right, what that's what that Peta. Bad, bad. Oh, Why? Peta. Why am I being so right. bad? Bad! Why? What is going on? You're Wait, bad. Look at the video. No, don't look at the video. You mean I the video you already video. sent I, me? I, I, I yeah, uh, one part of the video, it involves, uh, do you remember which, uh, Pokemon Chikorita is? No. No. Well, let me show you, uh, picture. Like, is this, right, is this the same video you sent me? Yeah. That I've already let me seen. show you a picture of Chikorita without you clicking it. I mean, oh, I wait! Think I, I know the- I think I know the video you're talking about. It's the Chikorita gets cut up and, like, has little- little bits pl pl uh, plucked off of it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Chikorita is a plant-based Pokemon that is a baby. I know, I know. I know video, too. Oh, I'm- I'm explaining the hatchet. Okay. I get it. I'm moving on. 
Honestly, okay, hot take. Everyone's like, oh, Gen 9 starters look really bad. Gen 2 had really basic starter designs. Like, they're not bad. I love Gen 2's starter designs, especially, like, the final evolutions. They were incredibly basic. I have to say, I always thought Chikra Rita was a very... What? I like them more than their evolution, but... I like the starter. Yeah. Yeah, Chikorita is very adorable. Yeah. You what, is any, is, into, like a flower dinosaur. Yeah. Also, is Jerry cutting out on anyone else's like end, yeah. or is it just a me issue again? A tiny bit here and there for me, but nothing yeah. major. Yeah. Yeah. And both of those gems have big mouth boys. It's this bookworm. Oh yeah, Gul I think Gulpin. No, Gulpin was added in Gen 3, wasn't it? Maybe. Actually, wait, let me look it up. Totodile yeah, and Fuey Coco. Fun, I think I'm gonna oh yeah! Me. Those are the big boys. What'd you say, Jerry? I'm basically gonna head out for the night, though this okay. has been very fun. Oh, okay. <laughs> See ya, Jerry. Have a good night. Uh, how, how are we only an hour and a half away from being- from you going to bed? Don't worry about it. I don't like time. Everyone, I have a very important proposition to bring before the House Senate. No. I have a very important proposition to bring before the Senate of the United States. What's that? Abolish time. I agree. They're like, oh, we should abolish uh, time saving. No, we need to abolish time. Get rid of time as a whole. Yes, no more as time. a concept and a whole. And how you how will you tell when it, uh, what time it what time it is? Well, see, it, Bec it, we won't no, have there to won't because be it a won't time. exist. We are abolishing we it. When, We're getting rid of it. How do we know when a breakfast, lunch, and dinner is? We uh, don't. We won't. Because there is no breakfast time, lunch time, or dinner time. There just is food time, and it's not called food time. It's called food now. Yeah. <laughs> Food now. <laughs> Food now in mouth. We'll just sound like a bunch of cavemen. Food now. It is food now time. Wait, no, not time. Food now. Food now. <laughs> food now, general, general place in space. Oh, oh wait, fuck, we can't say space time. Maybe, but how will you know when to plant or slash harvest cop crops? I almost said harvest you cops. Just... <laughs> Timer. <laughs> well, you see, that's... Well, no, you see, that's the thing. A lot of different cultures didn't actually have, like, means of telling, like, time of day. Those sorts of things. Like, they can just look, like, figure it out based upon the general things around them. You don't need to think about the concept of time. Because we don't need the concept of time. We can get rid of it. It's unnecessary. It just makes life sadder. Yeah, like the fact that I've spent a good majority of my fall break playing Pokemon. What? There's nothing bad to think about. There. My god, th my... My starter's gonna be near a level 100 by the time I get everyone to level 55. This is why you're supposed to do the Terra raids, so you get XP shit, and then well, you get the only to your... I keep getting are the one stars. They don't give shit. Actually, check how many uh, rare candies you have. Zero, I already checked. I had like seven, seventeen actually. Lucky you. How are you so unlucky? She's right. I have to kill the old-fashioned way. Hey, Bookworm, can I have your look for XP farming? I know you can give it to me. Plus me with your power. I believe in you, Bookworm. Bless me with your almighty power of X of XP farming. Farming. Oh, 
Brooklyn's just gonna look at me like, what the fuck? I have no luck, sorry. <laughs> Daru. I Give have no luck, Doru. Give me your luck hatchet. Nah. Fuck you. Fuck you. Okay, I'll give you my luck if you give me a basic uh, description of the concept of luck within Norse society. Fuck. Oh, god damn it. No, I looked this up. I have looked this up previously. I have, because I have earrings that actually represent luck. Uh, and I had to make sure it wasn't like... It, I know knew it was a Norse symbol, but I had to make, uh, look it up to make sure that no oh, yeah, Nazis had taken over it. Um, yeah. But it was a symbol of luck. And I for I looked up what like Norse luck meant, and I just completely forgot about it. No, God damn <laughs> it. you fool! Actually, I think I still have those earrings laying around somewhere. They are they're quite nice. So I like I like them. They have like a little fake uh, green yeah. gem at the bottom. I wish I took a picture of it, but when I was out driving today, to get gas. Um. I, I, I saw this sign, favorite sign, that said, help us support our NFT, and then there was a link under it. So the NFT bros can go outside, <laughs> but they, that's, oh, okay. You oh, wait, you play Pokemon Insurgents too, a bookworm? Nice. You would think someone tech-savvy enough to know what a fucking NFT is, would also know that no one in the modern day and age is going to take the time to manually punch in a link. Are you kidding me? <laughs> we, I, well, I do that sometimes. And, well, actually, no. Even more so. No one in the modern day and age is going to stop their fucking car to look out the window and manually punch in the link on their phone. Because it's a fucking billboard that you're going to see for a handful of seconds at most. Not only that, actually, fun fact, did you know it's been researched that, uh, yeah, billboards and advertisements along the street and shit, uh, make people depressed. Yeah. And it doesn't work as a marketing ploy at all. It does not work. Yeah. I don't know, I think Ocean said something like that. Oh, with the Norse luck thing. Oh, let me see. No, I know, I, I have a hunch about, like, the Norse luck thing, but I, it is, it has just escaped me. I cannot... Ah, uh, god damn it. Yeah, that's that's definitely a part of it. Um luck to the Norse was um from what we can tell based upon the scant bits of evidence that we've been able to gather after the Christians burnt everything. Uh Yay, was... <laughs> Thanks, right. Bright. Thanks for your input. <laughs> um, uh um, from what we can tell, basically, luck was a holistic way of understanding a person's capacity for well-being, both internal and external. It's commonly would have been viewed as, as Bookworm said, uh, being passed down and fostered through a relationship with the gods and through the ancestors, through reciprocity. But it could also be affected by your actions, the actions of others. Like, a whole bunch of things. Like, commonly, Norse curses were literally just trying to make someone's luck go away. I... Yeah, I, I feel like I've heard that, but I also kind of forgot about it. But yeah, that... Yeah, yeah. Which is ironic, because that's also, like, the main... If you don't know... Uh, do, do you know the origin of black cats being unlucky? As an idea? Uh, I know it has a mix of misogyny, but it also has a mix of, uh, something... D didn't the Norse view them as lucky, but Christians hated the Norse, and they were like, no, it's unlucky now? Yeah, basically. That's actually a, a pretty good way to sum it up. But more specifically, cats are heavily associated with the goddess Freya. Yeah, because uh, she was, likes cats. Yeah, who was very well liked by, uh, hangover... Norse witch practitioners out there in a lot of the like Nordic boonies of the time after Christianization. So they basically just developed this idea that black cats were witches and that all cats were unlucky and then it eventually turned into black cats are unlucky uh, because they realized, you know, 
Like, there is, or it's not quite that, but basically, yeah, like, that's the origin of that myth. Also, uh, the origin of Friday the 13th, uh, as being an unlucky thing, uh, that is also related to Freya. Uh, it was a day where pretty much everyone at the farms just got off and did things that were within a capacity of Freya's nature. Which, uh, Freya was a goddess of, uh, fertility, beauty, and love, as well as death and <laughs> war. Uh, what I'm trying to say is that they did a lot of things that I can't say right now. They did a lot of things what I, what I do to my apple and the ditto that I got Oh from god, no. No, don't, <laughs> don't take a sacred love make, uh, I shouldn't say that. A sacred day about love between people and turn it into the Whatever the fuck you Human breeding pit, yay! Shut up, shut up, go to hell. Not the good one, not the Norse one. Go to, go to Christian hell. <laughs> no, actually, one more thing there. is... I think another thing was with ta uh, cats being tied with being unlucky is, uh, especially with the misog misogyny part, is if I remember correctly, in Norse uh, like culture and shit, they would commonly give uh, like newlywed wives cats because, or, oh, I forget if it was newlyweds, or, like, if you wanted to propose to someone, it would be a cat. Because cats are cool as shit, and also had a tie with Freya. I don't know that one specifically, but it it tracks. And, like, mm -hmm. ultimately, like, the, the major things that led up to the Christians' over-the-top hatred of cats were associated with primarily female witches out in the boonies. So, it does track. And, uh, fun fact, there was a couple of popes who just straight up started to do a genocide of cats, like, like, between the 12 and 1300s. They were just like, you know what? All these damn cats, all, all these damn cats, they're evil, we're gonna get rid of them, every one of them. They're, isn't that, they're Satan in another form. Didn't, isn't that why, isn't that, like, one of the effects that caused the Black yeah. Plague is because they, there yeah. were no cats to eat rats, and thus rats became overpopulated. Exactly. And, uh, you know. They, they literally go, we hate these cats, we're killing all these cats, you see these cats? We hate them! Well, now there's a lot of rats around, aren't there? Why oh, are this? there spots on my skin? Why do <laughs> why? I feel like I'm dying? Oh, God! Father, father! Mr. Pope, why is my skin turning black? No, that's not uh, really bad. Well, I mean, that's why it was called the Black Death. It literally caused, there, like, yeah. lesions that would change the skin color black. True, true. Like, it was so, literally, like, splotches of necrosis. Yeah. Um, so, okay, so here's the thing. Uh, she started streaming, so I went in there and said hi. They asked how Subathon going. Not to say anything, so I said, good, still going, and fine with the orphans. What? Yeah, okay. That tracks. <laughs> I have to resort to my old faithful image editing software, also known as uh, <laughs> Microsoft Paint. <laughs> I have hatched 30, 40 eggs. Okay, 90 eggs, actually. I have hatched 90 eggs so far. 90 apples are going to be released into the wild. You know what or, the best well, kind of meat is, Hatchet? What? I, I, I saw from the cartoon there's one meat that's the best kind of that is That is the best kind of meat. And it's orphan meat. You really need to just stop talking. It make it can, you can make it into an orphan meat dragon. Just just cease. <laughs> I don't feel very safe. <laughs> no one should feel safe when when brights around. Good point. Bright probably shouldn't feel safe when brights around. Good point. Bright probably doesn't feel safe when brights around. Bright, do you feel safe right now? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, oh, oh! You downloaded it because I you saw me play it, Bookworm. Yeah, it's real fun, and you can choose your own mode and choose what type of story 
if, if you want the dark or pussy version. <laughs> I chose what? the uh, uh, Pokemon Insurgents. Either do you want to do the regular, uh, regular story of no cults or story of cults? I chose cults. Long live cults. Yes. Not. It gets it gets pretty dark. Yeah, I picked the dark version. <laughs> Me and Bookworm picked the same yeah, version. All, all, basically, all of this conversation was to say, uh, there's a long history of Christians, like surrounding the Middle e medieval ages, doing really fucking weird things that ultimately killed more people than they helped. Yeah. Because they helped no one. The only Which is thing not is... surprising in the least. There's only one part of Christian history you shouldn't talk with a child, and that's the Irish Catholics. <laughs> and we know why. If you're talking about the... Uh, essay situation, that's not the first thing I think of. Oh no, I'm talking about where they kidnapped four people's children and did whatever they wanted with them. Okay, yeah, then yeah, that is... Yeah. Yeah, you didn't know that? <laughs> they did that, that's no, actually... I... No, yeah. I know that. Like, I know about it. It's just also one of the things I don't like to think about because it's, like, yeah. abnormally fucked up. Like, even for, like, the history of Christian colonization of places, like, it's yeah. abnormally fucked up.